And it is time to take a walk on the wild side with our friends from the Palm Beach Zoo. Joining us now, Elizabeth Anderson, Associate Curator, and Angela Ledford, Media Relations Manager, and also Wilbur, a Hoffman's two-toed sloth, who I understand is actually a girl. Wilbur is. <laughs> so cute. Tell us a little bit about Wilbur's role at the zoo. Well, Wilbur has the opportunity to share her conservation story every day in our Wild Things show. And then she makes special appearances throughout the zoo on busy days and then when we have uh, educational programs and zoo events. Wilbur's amazing. I mean, what a cool animal, right, to enjoy. Talk to us a little bit about how we can help to protect sloths when they're in the wild. That's a great question, and you're right, she is amazing, and a lot of people, especially recently, have just become totally obsessed with sloths. <laughs> And uh, that's actually one of the major threats facing them in the wild is capture for the pet trade. Mm. But unfortunately, between the capture and the commute and then improper housing and food, a majority of the animals captured never make it to their final destination. So this loss of life is not only bad for the species, but it also impacts the environment where the animals come from because it depends on these animals to maintain a balanced ecosystem. So in spite of this, um, people will pay very high prices for exotic animals. And the exotic animal trade rakes in about $20 billion a year. Wow. So um, every time someone buys an exotic animal, they are contributing and there's more smuggling that happens. So we recommend if you want a pet to contact a rescue or a local animal shelter and just avoid the industry completely. Of course. Well, we want to take care of beautiful animals like Wilbur. Um, talk to us. I know that you know Wilbur is not the only star at the zoo this weekend. Talk to us a little bit about who we can meet for the first time out there. This is so exciting for us, Ashley, because today you can meet our new baby taper calf, less than two weeks old, and she <laughs> is adorable. Starting at 11 a.m. today, you can go to the taper exhibit, and you will see her with her mom. She is the cute thing. Look at her. <laughs> Yesterday, this is the first time ever you're seeing the first few seconds that she went out into the taper so habitat. Cute. She's been behind the scenes for her safety and her health. Her first medical checkup went great, so we're really excited because she is an endangered species. Baird's tapers in the wild need to be extremely protected, so we're really thrilled about this birth. Mom and baby are doing great. Also, another star animal that we've talked about before here is Mirasol, our Florida panther, mm -hmm. and our Save the Florida Panther Day is coming up March 15th, so a couple of Saturdays from now, from 11 a.m to 3 p.m. at the zoo. You can come out, learn more about Florida panthers, as well as the other endangered species that are affected by Florida wildlife. We'll have children's arts and crafts and a lot of fun things for the kids and parents. Amazing. Thank you both so much. As always, we really enjoy this. And thank you, Wilbur. So fun to see you. <laughs> we'll be right back. Stay with us.